next page, I'm going to do exactly the same. Just making a flippity flop with my A4 pages, 21 by 29 and a half centimeters, uh, or 8 one fourth by 11 five of an eight inch. Fold it double. And that's my tunnel, the base, the base, the base tunnel. The base tunnel is done, then it ends by eight one fourth and five and a half inch, and in centimeters that is twenty one by fourteen centimeters. Yay! So let's get started on the next one i have something in mind something playful but i'm just going to try it out <laughs> okay now of course i like to add as much as possibilities for adding photos in here so the first thing i like to do is create a page on top and I do like some playful edges, so I'm just going to use a scrap piece. And that is, this is 7 one fourth. So I'm going to make a flippity flop. Oops. Fold it down. And now let's see, I want to flip this up, again I'm going to flip this up, and I'm going to make a mark, make it a little smaller, make it possible to to attaching nicely on this page. So yeah, this is going to be up, so let's add this. going to eyeball this if this is equal on each side all right so we have a nice photo frame at the back and at the bottom and at the top I want something new I want to try something out Okay, yes, so let's see how that works. Okay, the first thing that I like to do is try to keep an eye on that you are still see everything what I do. So I will use this so it's more easy to see you. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, split this piece in four pieces. And... Yeah, I am terrible at this. Yeah, I know. And someone told me... Wait just a second. Someone told me a nice suggestion, which need to be... Of course. Wait just a second. Someone told me, if you are not used to make... Then just do it this way can be of course but yeah you can use your ruler and I'm better in centimeters than in inches but this is also a good way so yeah it is <laughs> okay let's make a mark right here 
And here, so that is the middle. On here. Yes. And then, of course, I need the middle of this piece too. So. I'm just I'm just going to use this method because someone told me so <laughs> it works perfectly. Yes, it does. I should use just my ruler, but hey, I just want to try out this method. I always like tips, and I always like to try things out. Okay, so. Now I have that middle. Hmm. Now I have no clue if this is going to be working, but I thought it will be fun. So I'm just going to do it. <laughs> Alright, so let's make four flippity flop things. I want to add some activity. Well, not some. This is going to be pretty. Well, busy. Well, I do not know. Let's grab some piece of paper. And we need to be sure that this is the same size as the half we just drew. Yes. Okay. That's all step one, the same size as one. Now I am going to make a flippity flop first one piece. The meaning, the meaning is, I'm gonna tell you what the meaning is. I want four little things, four little pieces that flips open. Now the first one is going to be to the left. This piece I want up, this piece I want to the right, and this piece goes down. Alright, so this goes to the left, this goes up, this goes right, and this goes down. Disco, disco, disco. <laughs> Alright, so we need two that needs this flippity flop. So let's start with this piece right here. I'm gonna lay this as I'm just going to glue this down, make my mark, and I'm just staying just a little fragile away from that line. Then, mm, yeah, I'm just going to cut it, that's easier. Let's cut this down and let's attach this. make another flippity flop. Because this is still the same size. Now this goes down, so the flippity flop needs to go down, under. So let's assume that I'm going to apply this right here. And then I don't want to bump in here, but it won't because this is going to be down. But I'm just going to measure this up so it fits. Okay, make a line and cut it down. It's better than it's all, all the way around, just a slightly smaller than that it's too big. If it's too big, it bumps on each other, so that is not what we like. So stay attention on the other parts. You don't want to mess this up. And it's my first time trying this out, so join me. Join my little journey of trying something out. 
Okay, so now we have an up and down. And these two goes to the outside. All right, so let's say, let's grab another piece. Search for some piece that I do have left. Why use papers if you are having the perfect size already? Oh wait, but this needs to go this way. So that means, yeah, I still can make this happen. I think. Well, wait just a second. Why then grab not a smaller one? Let's say... Let's say this one fits too. Yes, this fits. So I'm just going to make this fit. And of course you need to stay away from that edge. So I'm going to cut this just a slightly smaller. Let's do that first before I forgot. Do I forgot something? No, I always forget something. I'm just going to cut a slightly piece off. And then I'm going to make a flippity flop on the small side. Fold it over. And then make that mark. Okay, so and let's say I'm going to glue it down right here. Gosh, I don't see. I see a terrible wait just make it happen that you will see it too see this is the end of this little page right here just make that mark now make it happen just glue this down right here and it needs to be not interfering anything it still needs to go nicely open and close this one okay what I see is that this needs to go just slightly piece. It's just a minor screw piece, but I don't want to bump in each other. So that is why I'm just going to do this right now. Yep, that is better. I think. Yep. And this one on top needs to go also just a little it's just a matter of matting i know but that's way better yes it is now i hope i have everything straight i do not know if everything <laughs> This does not look very nice, does it? Hmm. Well, this looks terrible, don't you think? This is really not what I was thinking. Hmm. <laughs> it's terrible matting, I know. It is. But perhaps at the end, I'm just going to continue. Yes, I am. I'm just going forward. Let's see what happens. Could have done a better job at this, but... That's the meaning of a tryout. Now the matting is just completely my mistake. It should have been nicely straight, perfectly against each other. <laughs> but it isn't. 
it is not. I just have to admit that. And I just grabbed another piece of paper, which is also not the same as I dust it in just a second. Okay, make it work. I am do the best I can. Okay, let's glue this on. See, I'm not a perfect cutter myself. Just going to do the best I can. Especially black on black, that's terrible. But we're doing the best we can. Okay, this is not going in the way. This is, well, just slightly, just. of nothing and this is also a little in the way just a little just a little bit and where will we go if we don't have a knife to fix it up okay are we still in that picture? In the vibes. Let's see how it looks like. Oh, it's not that bad. No, it isn't. It's not. If I would do it, I will cut this piece just a little further. So then we have a nice equal it's not that bad. No, it isn't. Just cut a little tiny piece of here and that's that. I think now it's way better. See? Just make it work, make it work. See? Yeah, this is better. No bumping in each other. Left, up, right, down. Yeah, cool. But that's not all. No, 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 no. That's not all. We like to do something more. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay, so let's continuing this crazy page. First thing, what we are going to do is I'm going to make a little pocket on this one. Um, let's grab just some leftover pieces and let's cut this. Well, let's see how wide is this? This is two, three, four, yeah, one inch. That is enough. A nice one inch black strip. Let's make a little flippy flop. Am I still in frame? Not completely. No, okay, let's measure this. How wide does it need to be? And then again, making a flip flop. Okay, that's the first thing. Let's put this on. Just don't forget the bottom, but you can always do that later. Oh, 
Okay, so we have just a tiny little tuck spot right here. The meaning is that we add, let's say, a little um, piece right here that keeps that close. See? Now, I want, of course, this to be close too. So the next thing that we're going to do is, um, let's say, um, well, is it enough to make another one here that this is closed? I think it does. Actually, the meaning was that I will go around it, but I think if I make a pocket down here too, that that is the thing already. All right, so I'm gonna cut another one inch. make another pocket see what happens see what happens go with the flow be aware of my crazy journey <laughs> Okay, let's glue this on. At the bottom. And yeah, I think it does. Well, this one is a little heavier, but... I think actually it does. It does put this all down. Alright, so we have... Yeah, I think this will flip down. One, up, up, up. That is functional. And it's still... See? This will hold this page down. And this page will hold this down. So, yeah, I think yeah, it needs, it needs to be flattened down, but see, that's better. When it's all flat and wet papers, then I don't think we need to add anything more. Okay, that was not actually what I had in mind. <laughs> what I had in mind was that I did make a nice um, one here too. Here, let's do that. Let's just do that. Let's go crazy. Why not? I'm just going to do what I had in mind. What the planning was. I also have a little one. Let's grab the little one. And just go with the flow what I had in mind. But I'm not going to glue this down just yet. I'm just going to see what I had in mind. Because if I do this not ugly but 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 if I glue this here and I have a little pocket right there if is it then still nice hmm, yeah actually it is oh, yes let's glue it down let's make some nice little cute tags where you can add cute little photos on or write something in there 
I like that. I like the little pockets. Go. Then, of course, we do want to make another one on that other little piece. Okay, so shall then we make this on this side? Let's do that. Let's make mock. Here we go. Glue it down. Go wild. Let's go crazy. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. That is the crazy part. So we have a pocket here, there, and there, and here below. All right. And when it's all done with the, with the, yeah, I think it's fun, cute. Yes, 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 yes. I am gonna make some photo mats inside so you can add a nice lyric on here that is what I'm gonna do next inside here I make another nice photo frame as but perhaps now one with the words that is I think nice I'm just going to start. Oh my gosh. Actually, I wasn't planning on doing this without you. Oh. Yes, I am going to leave you. Do you want me to leave? <laughs> so, this is what I'm going to do. I am going to use these strips all the way around. Same as I would do with my, with these, the black and white squares. And then I'm just going to decorate. I'm going to decorate it all. Oh yes, now I can use these just a little tinier. Go. Oh no, actually I should have sing for you guys the song from this one, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here we go, here we go. Yes, and now a nice white piece that I do have down here. Let's measure. Let's measure it up. think about last night we, we started a few days ago a new series to watch and that's called the bridge <laughs> and I absolutely love uh, that series so far so good but it's not a, an, an, an unfamiliar language it's Danish or Swedish or they mix it all up because they are um, police detectives or something like that and um, the one is Danish and the other one is Swedish 
and I absolutely love the humor in it and uh, but the language I do love the language you know I do love um, different languages and which I definitely not speak that much languages but I do love love to hear them and when I am Dutch and when I hear Swedish and Danish um, yeah I we we both <laughs> say the same thing that um, once in a while if we hear them speak I hear Dutch words and I hear uh, Deutsch uh, Germanish uh, words um, in it too and oh my gosh I just love it <laughs> I really love the sound of it and um, yeah that's just what I want to show you I love it <laughs> it's a good series by the way but it's not the first series we watch with a different language um, we also watched a Turkish series and we also watched a, Spani uh, a few Spanish Spain series um, yeah so we are getting to know it more and more um, different different um, languages too just by watching some series ah, that's cool okay I, I like this this is awesome I'm gonna add something more on here but that I am gonna do off camera I think yes but now this is closed what do you think is this too much off or uh, I think this could be a little more straight. This is a little off. See? This is definitely off. So let's adjust that a little better. We want this straight. Straight as possible. Oh yeah, that's way better. So now we still can change a bit if you like. I see that I do like it here too. Just a tiny little bit, not too much. Because if I mess up, I mess up big time. Now with the white, we can change it. Oh yeah, see, that is nice. That is perfect. Yes, I like that. Okay, so if we add something in here, this is a booklet, so this is a little heavier. This will stay down, and this will stay down, and if I then make two little tags on here yeah that's nice I like that oh my bad stomach is a little noisy um, yeah cool I like this just a little funky a funky way that is cool keep it all nice and straight flat yes I am gonna decorate this and then this is easy easy going photo mat here same with the black and white I do like to come there let it come back and then this I will keep it plain too yes I do all right but which color combination do I like? Well, the first one was wet and yellow. And this was, yeah, these are actually all three colors, but green and yellow. Let's see, which one did I not use? Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, we do not have that much choice. So I think I am going to continue in with 
I think I will let the flower come back at the edge. Yes, that is the first thing I'm gonna do. Let the flower speak back. Oh, shall I make this one? Yeah, that is nice. That bluish one. Let us start with this and then yeah, I'm just going to continue and see if I will. Do you like me to film? Perhaps you do. <laughs> then I will just keep my camera rolling. Well, sometimes I do like crafting with some nice music on the background. So, but yeah, that is not possible, of course, on camera. Otherwise, you can be um, that your noise is going to be off. I did have that experience um, way in the beginning when I was doing this I thought oh my gosh okay there are some silent moments when I craft and I thought in the beginning that you guys was perhaps getting bored of that so I thought why not put a nice music on the background so people can also listen a bit to the to the radio. I had no clue. <laughs> okay, so when I edit my video, um, YouTube was turning all sounds. The 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 how you call that? They turn off the sound from the not only that. Um, there was one song that has, oh, what do you call it, Alter White, something like that. Anyway, that could not be um, on YouTube. So they had to turn off the sound. And not only that, no, they turn off the completely um, all the, the sound. So also my brabbling and also yeah everything so actually the complete video was a little was a little bit um, ruined but yeah that is what it oh this is nice what do you think a nice border but that is the lesson that I learned from that mistake don't put any radio or music on on the background but sometimes I miss that but yeah that's just that's just a thing that is not possible all right so um, I am going to cut this little piece of that sheet and I am gonna cut this in the right position and that is my frame because we want to add pictures in this album of course it's all about memories save your memories Okay, yep, that is nice. Nice, 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 nice. I can, if I like, I can, well, no, I think one photo frame is enough. And that is that I'm gonna do right here. That is easy going. So that is not what I'm gonna film. I can make this also as a photo frame but I'm not going to do that we just made this as a photo frame so now we are going to use what 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 well I do. 
I do gonna make it a little simpler. No. Mm. What do you want? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I think a green one will be good. Oh, by the way, I do have these two. So I can use this also for background. Or this one. Ooh. <laughs> That's busy. That's really busy. Let's just use the green one. Yeah, let's do that. Let's use the green one. Or I can wait. Shall I wait? Yeah, that's also a possibility. I'm just going to wait for just a second and just going to make the strips right here. So I need to cut more strips and uh, well, and then I go to the front. So I'll be back in one second. Okay, I decided still to do the green one and of course that same photo mat now let's see what we have left I absolutely love these ones so I'm gonna use these it's hard to see perhaps it's better to first do the background but I always like to do the background at, at last So let's add these little ones, one here, and then perhaps it's nice to let this come back at the top. Yep. Now I will save these for later. I think two pockets is enough with that. And now I'm just going to add something what I already have. So I think let's use the home tea don't. We did oh wait just a second. Um if this is this page right here, then I already have that Humpty Dumpty. Mm. Well, I like this to come back, so I am going to use this first. Add the right size. Smooch a bit. So yeah, I try to match with the left and the right page. But yeah, sometimes I still switch the pages, so Sometimes that's not always true, but I try at least. Alright, so let's see what do I have left on pages. I always like to use first what I have, of course. Use what you have. Well, I still can use this Humpty Dumpty as, well, let's use it on this one, why not, let's use this piece right here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
and of course if you use other papers um, this is not exactly what you need to do it's just an example for what I like you don't see now you see that edge okay let's see <laughs> let's see um, we do have oh yeah we have this this paper too mm, well I do like this one too better okay let's cut this piece right here and I think that I will go for the background I'm gonna use that black and white I think that's a good choice And I have to be honest, at first I do not like these papers, but yeah, and that's normal with Craft 45, it matches all, it does, it does match, so don't be afraid of using them, because they do match. That's the magic of the graphic 45. I always say that. The colors are always matching. And yeah, I add a little black and white on it but yeah for the rest it does fit nicely I do like the color combinations a bit more Just make a nice little strip. The strip was one inch, so I need to be a little smaller. Then it will fit. Here we go. is just a tiny bit smaller but that's okay because I can add a little piece on it to cover that up here we go I don't see. Oh yeah. Now I see. Okay. So the pockets are covered up. I keep it simple. And I think I want to mix and match it a bit. So what else? I do have another one. I do have this one. Now, uh, I don't know why, but these papers, yeah, I do love black and white and I'm gonna use them because I think black and white easiest down the papers. But I can't explain why they put a sticker on top, on top a design paper because I did my best to try 
peel this off. And I don't think... See? That is a total waste of papers. It won't come off nicely, so I won't. I let it down. But, yeah, I completely do not understand why they did it. But they did. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna use these two with this black. So, I need a small piece, so why not use this right away. I'm just going to cut right off this piece. I think it's stupid to, st stupid to put the sticker on, making memories, that's makingmemories.com. I think it's stupid, but that's just my opinion. Okay, let's cut this. This is still a nice piece which I can use. Maybe in a later stage. You never know with me. Okay, so I do use some easy black and white paper extra with it. Just to. Oh, this needs just a little shot. Thought I had it perfectly. Nope, now it is. Yes, put it on its place, please. Yes, that eases down. See, that's a nice little pocket. That's cool. Now I'm gonna use this one here. Now I saw, wait just a second, did I, oh I think I already cut that off, the other one, so that's no problem. Okay then, let's go, let's make this also a little deeper, and you see this, not too good. Here we go. Yes, perfect. See how the colors go quiet. And yeah, these two can be needed some color, so it pops up that there are four different shapes. So, which color do we like? Mm. I think on this piece some yellow. Where is that yellow page? Oh yeah, that yellow we did use it already. So, but I want to use it again. Oh, this bluish one is also nice. Nope, I go for the yellow. Yellow on this piece right here. Let's make the same size as your pocket and then a little lower. Oh, yes, here we go. Oh my god, I'm really having fun. And like I said, normally I hate busy papers or, or these colors. They are normally not my thing. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know why, but I'm just getting in the mood. Yes, I like this. And now I want a wet color on here. Um, 
this one we did not use. So I'm going to use this piece. Oh my, such small pieces for such a small... Mm. Okay, but it's okay. A little deeper. Here is that mark. <laughs> Here we go. And oh, that's a really tiny piece, but it was needed. So no worries. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, and I will do not do that right now, but when the time is there, I'm going to make cute little tiny tags for in here. They are cute. They are going to be cute. Keep your leftovers, always. Always keep your leftover pieces. Right by your side. The bigger pieces are right there. Yeah, I have to clean up a little bit more. Everything is going to be in my way. Yes, that, this is better. Whew. Okay. Um. Yeah. What shall we do on the inside of these? What do you think? Oh, why is that noise? Hmm, that's strange. Anyway, um, shall I do just nice photo frames? I think that's a nice, nice idea. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna make some photo frames right here so people can uh, put their photos on. That's a good idea. Or shall I keep them plain? Hmm, what do you think? Because sometimes you can write something in white there too. And if people like to add a photo, that's still possible. I will leave it just for now. I will leave it. But how does this look right here? With a pocket right here. And let's say this is going to be a little tag pocket and then um, I need a little sample. Let's say that this is a little tag too and then you can add this. It will stay flat and then on this side too it will stay flat. Yes and if you are doing a larger one that's also a possibility. Let's grab this one. Then this lay flat too and then you can add this one or yeah whatever whatever but these pockets are the closures too with these yeah i like that and then of course when you're adding um when you are put these as stoppers then this will close down everything Yes, yeah, I like it. Cool, 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 cool. Fun, but cool. All right, let's go to the other side. Uh, fun! <laughs>